Now let us move on to the third bit. The third number given is 3825. To express 3825 as a product of its prime factors, we shall factorize it. And the least number that goes in 3825 is 3. Therefore, this can be written as 3 times of 1275. 1275 can be written as 3 times of 425 and 425 can be written as 5 times of 85 and 85 can be written as 5 times of 17. Therefore, 3825 is expressed as 3 times 3 times 5 times 5 times 17 which implies 3825 is equal to 3 square times 5 square times 17 hence 3825 is expressed as a product of its prime factors now let us move on to the fourth bit in the question the fourth number given is 5005 so to express 5005 as a product of its prime factors we shall factorize it the least prime number that goes in 5005 is 5 so it can be expressed as 5 times of 1001 1001 can be expressed as 7 times 143 and 143 can be written as 11 times 13 therefore 5005 can be expressed as 5 times 7 times 11 times 13 hence 5005 is written as a product of its prime factors now let us move on to the fifth bit given therefore the fifth number given is 7429 to express 7429 as a product of its prime factors we shall factorize this 7429 can be written as 17 times 437 as 17 is the least prime number that goes in 7429 and again 437 can be written as 19 times 23 therefore 7429 is equal to 17 times 19 times 23. Hence, the given number is a product of its prime factors.